Hallelujah, that was a very swear. And there, I pledge that in the service of the state of Nigeria, I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to the federal republic of Nigeria at all times. I will be well and truly serve in the state of Nigeria in the office of head of service of the state of Nigeria. I will not discriminate on the basis of religion, crime, court, or status, or practice any form of impartiality. That was the swearing-in of Mr. Kolawole Peter Fagbon as the 19th head of service in Ogun State at the executive chambers of the governor's office in Okemoson, Abeokuta. Governor Dapo Abiodo, in his charge, urged the new head of service to bring to the fore his vast experience as a seasoned administrator. The appointment is a call to service of Nigeria State in a fresh capacity and dedication to duty as a servant of the people. The appointment is a rare opportunity to serve, which he must guard very jealously. The governor also charged permanent secretaries and the entire workforce to extend their maximum cooperation and support to the new number one civil servant, assuring them that his administration remains resolute in the well-being and welfare of civil and public servants. Let me charge you all to extend the maximum cooperation and support to the new head of service that you have called his predecessors. He needs your full support and commitment to succeed. Administration will continue to support the civil service and ensure a conducive atmosphere not only for our public servants to thrive and maximize their potentials, but also to get the peak of their careers. In his response, the new head of service, Mr. Kolawole Fagbun, assured Governor Dakwa Biodun that the civil service under his watch will involve a culture of high performance and productivity in all the various ministries, departments, and agencies. My humble resolve to effectively deploy all machinery and resources to be the disposal of the health service to complement the excellence of the efforts and successfully implementing the acquisitions with the future of the government. He also thanked him for finding him worthy of the office of the head of service of Ogun State.